What's up guys, and I just finished painting my Infernus Marines, and my friends at school have been telling me, Jameson, when's your 10k sub special? When is it? And, well, y'all might not know this, but tomorrow we are heading to Universal, and I'll be doing a two 10k sub specials. That sub special will be trading a penny all the way up to a hundred dollars, possibly. If I can't do that, $50. Because I'll be at Universal for five days. I think I can do that. So today, I'm going to be getting out this table and showing y'all all of my completed Space Marines. Let's get into it. Okay, guys. So we are in my workspace, which is kind of nasty right now. We have this right here, which is in my terrain, which I can't show because it would show the surprise. And down here we have my Leviathan book and Madison's sort of painted army. And we are going to start start off three. These are all the plates I start my army on. Who won? Here is my full 1,800-ish point army. We have Infernus Marines. Flamestorm Aggressors, Infiltrators, Stern Guard Veterans, a Ballistic Dreadnought, a, um, I forgot what it's called, but it's like a tank, two Captains of Terminator Armor, a, um, li Primaris Librarian, a Librarian in Terminator Armor, and these two guys, I've forgotten the name. This is probably my best painted model. I spent an entire day working on this sucker. He's one of my favorite. We have two squads of Terminators, a squad of Primaris Intercessors, and then whenever I went to Comic-Con, they had freebies, let me move that, they have freebies for freebie Space Marine Intercessors, and me and family and friends were able to give me a whole squad of those for free, and that is my entire army, so now we're going to go into the my favorite guys which are my terminators they're super good they each have three wounds and they shoot they're really good at taking out termagants and they're pretty good this christmas i asked for the christmas box that will hopefully add me some more intercessors because i need some chain swords for my blood angels right here we have one chain sword which is kind of bloody i think i want a little crazy on the blood but yeah i got some blood for the blood god and i'll paint all over it then we have the the freebies which are all which i painted the exact same way they all have terminator symbols on them because i didn't know those were actually four terminators so they have the smaller symbols but right here we have their little stand which it came with their head bobbles and next up we have my two captains this is the first warhammer model i ever painted right here came out okay and then this was my this is now my main captain because he got painted nicely i painted it whenever we were at a friend's house one day and it turned out really nicely then we i think this is a lieutenant i don't know but he got painted in like a day. He's really cool. He has, I think, some sort of flamestorm gauntlet or whatever on the back. No, this is a repulsor tank. There. And this one's really cool. I, I built this at my grandma's. And it's one of the coolest things in my army. And then I have a story about this guy right here. This is my Ballistic Dreadnought. And you can notice he has like wax and stuff right here. And his arms will come off, but they're, like, super hard to put back on. So, y'all get to see my extra stepper sec. There you go. Yeah, I'll grab my terrain that I made in a sec. Or it might be up here. It's actually back here. So, yeah, this is the terrain I made. It's been a while on that. And this is what I got at the Comic-Con. I got some plushies we have the librarians which i 
painted pretty quickly because you there's a lot of red on these guys my i forgot what he's called he's the healer dude and the dreadnought next up and madison actually broke his legs off the other day so i had to glue those back together next up we have the stern guard which i painted all right they're 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 really good painted in my standard i think i painted them really good they have like all different helmets and all that. Then there's the um infiltrators, which are ready to destroy. It was either these or the incursors, and I heard the incursors were terrible, so I did the infiltrators. Then we have my favorite unit, or one of my second favorite unit, the aggressors. These guys almost took out a demons, um, a giant like demons guy and he was super strong and they're my least favorite models to paint in the whole world i don't know why but they're just so s terrible to paint i don't like them these are my infernus marines i have uh 10 man squad and a five man squad three man squad five five one 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 five 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 so with the um Christmas box, if I get it, I'll have a 10 man and a 5 man. I'll jump pack intercessors. And I'll have some outriders. Can I show you Madison's Army 2 real quick? It's okay painted. This guy, I think I went to, I painted this at my grandma's. And Madison wants his tyrannids to be super bloody and gory. So that's how they turned out. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. This is, on, this is not like my full 10k sub special. This is like a tiny one. My actual 10K sub special will be posted on Friday afternoon, possibly. I will be karate testing for my red belt on Friday. And I will, of course, make a video about that. So, yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed. And this is my Warhammer 40,000 Army, my 10K sub special number one.